This is the exact capture location. Babies were being pushed away from their mothers. Lassoed, netted. You talk about pain, you should hear 30 or 40 whales screaming. Their whole goal was to generate revenue. They gave her a show name. They called her Lolita. She's hurting, and she's not getting the care she needs. She's all alone. They would make the decision just not to feed her anymore. The first time I was in the water with her, you can't see past her face. It's just huge. How can this whale be in this small tank? This is ridiculous. We got to get down there. We'll bring you home. She's more than just a captive whale. She is our family. There's a Native American tribe now claiming ancestral rights to this animal, and they wanted this animal back in her natal waters where she belonged. That's a hell of a story. No one's ever told this story. She's already been there 52 years. Our great-grandparents, when they got taken off to boarding school, the savage was taken out of them. She went off to boarding school, and she's still there. It's not hard to capture whales. What I think we've learned over time is how hard it is to put one back. She's a corporate asset. We don't own her. They never granted me permission on park grounds. She's there. You can't hide a whale. We have caused, as human beings, so much destruction, but there is hope. How is she doing today? Not great. 